Welcome to Children's Worship. May the Lord be with you. Today I have another story about Easter. You know the mystery when Jesus died and God made Jesus alive again? Well, this one takes place three days after Jesus died. Here's a tomb, and it's a special place to put the dead. After Jesus died, Joseph of Arimathea took Jesus' body and put him in the tomb, and he rolled the big stone in front of the doorway. Well, early one morning, on Sunday, three days later, Mary Magdalene, Mary the mother of James, and Salome all went to the tomb with spices to anoint Jesus' body. Along the way, they wondered, who's going to move that big, heavy stone blocking the door for us? Well, as they got closer, they were very surprised because the stone had already been rolled away from the doorway. They went in the tomb. Jesus was gone. They were very afraid. And then they saw a man dressed in a white robe. And he said, do not be afraid. Jesus is alive. Go tell the disciples, and especially Peter, that Jesus is going ahead of you to Galilee, just as he said he would. Meet him there. Well, the women were amazed and they quickly ran from the tomb. They were afraid to tell the people that Jesus was alive. Well, a very special thing happened. God made Jesus alive again. Jesus arose from the dead. And the very first person that he went to talk to was Mary Magdalene. Well, after talking to Jesus, Mary was no longer afraid to tell all of Jesus' friends that he was still alive. She said, Jesus is alive. I talked to him. I saw him. Meet him in Galilee, just as he said. But the people did not believe her. Wow. I wonder how Mary Magdalene felt when her very special friend Jesus died. And I wonder how Mary Magdalene felt when she went to visit Jesus' tomb. I wonder how all the women felt when Jesus' body was no longer there. And I wonder why they were too afraid to tell people that Jesus is alive. I wonder how Mary Magdalene felt when Jesus appeared to her. I wonder why the people did not believe Mary Magdalene when she told them that Jesus was alive. I wonder what she will do. Okay, let's see if we can find our story in the Bible. It's from the Gospel of Mark, chapter 16. It's called Jesus is Alive. After the after the Sabbath, Mary Magdalene, Salome, and Mary the mother of James bought some, brought some spices to put on Jesus' body. Very early on Sunday morning, just as the sun was coming up, they went to the tomb. And on their way, they were asking one another, who will roll the stone away from the entrance for us? But when they looked, they saw the stone had already been rolled away, and it was a huge stone. Well, the woman went into the tomb, and on the right side, they saw a young man in a white robe sitting there. They were alarmed. 
The man said, don't be alarmed. You're looking for Jesus from Nazareth, who was nailed to a cross. God raised him to life and he isn't here. You can see the place where they put his body. Now go and tell his disciples, and especially Peter, that he will go ahead of you to Galilee. You will see him there, just as he told you. When the women ran from the tomb, they were confused and shaking all over. They were too afraid to tell anyone what happened. Well, very early on the first day of the week after Jesus had risen to life, he appeared to Mary Magdalene. And she left and told his friends who were crying and mourning. And even though they heard that Jesus was alive and that Mary had seen him, they would not believe it. The end. That is the word of the Lord. Well, it was nice talking with you all. I miss you. I hope you guys are hanging in there with uh, staying at home all day long. Um, hopefully we'll get back to church and get to hang out again soon. Bye.